dogs and cats can get infected with roundworm eggs and larvae almost anywhere. They can pick up worm eggs from their surroundings as they rummage around. The eggs are swallowed and enter the gut, where larvae hatch from the worm eggs. Depending on the animal's age and the strength of its immune system, the larvae penetrate the intestinal wall and embark on their migration through the body. They enter the blood vessels and are carried in the bloodstream to various organs. These organs are damaged by the migratory movements of the worm larvae. In young animals, the larvae often travel to the liver and then to the lungs via the bloodstream. From here, they reach the trachea, are coughed up, swallowed, and travel through the esophagus to the intestine, where they settle and develop into mature egg-laying adults. Adult worms can produce up to 200,000 eggs daily. The worm eggs, which are invisible to the naked eye, are excreted in the animal's feces. They're able to survive for several years in the soil and act as a source of infection for other animals. Some of the worm larvae migrating around the body do not return to the intestine. They become encapsulated, mainly in the muscles, and enter a state of dormancy. These arrested larvae in the muscles are the reason why worms are transmitted from the bitch to her pups. During the final trimester of pregnancy, the dormant larvae are reactivated by hormones. They travel to the uterus via the bloodstream and infect the unborn pups. Other larvae reach the mammary gland via the bloodstream. Newborn puppies and kittens can then be infected through their mother's milk.